Hello my friends, my name is Dadcraft73 and welcome back to another episode from the Truly Bedrock Let's Play server. Oh man, I hope you're having a good day. I hope you're taking care of yourself and you're doing all right. That is for sure and for certain. Oh man, okay. <laughs> we have stuff to do right away at the beginning of this episode. Jenny's number. Uh, we have to go over to listen. Well, let me, I'm a little short on rockets. Let me square that away first. That we have some errands to run, and we're going to do it here uh, on the uh, at the beginning of this video. Just be, oh my goodness, I have literally. Wow, I use so many rockets nowadays. <laughs> I'm so lazy. I don't want to walk anywhere. All my stuff is repaired. All right, let me go and see if I can't find a couple rockets. And then we've got a hand, hand. Oh my goodness, head over to the Christmas area, the winter area, and check to see who we have for Secret Santa. Oh man, I gotta make paper. I'll see you in just a second. Okay, a few minutes later, using Gruva's crazy sugarcane farm, we got stacks on stacks of rockets. We're good to go. This is DB's tunnel. This is a tunnel out to the winter area. He like uh, was working on it on this live stream. It looks really good. I love like the nether particles. Like I guess that's a basalt delta or whatever makes those like gray ones. It looks like snow. Oh man, I love it. Yeah, it is a basalt delta because if we go up here around the corner, I think, yeah, we go up these steps and if it's like it used to be, there's like a viewport out into the basalt delta. Yeah, look at that. Oh, I love it. It's almost like DB, DB planned that. What's that right there? Oh, that's the way to get out. We don't want to go there. Okay, let's go over to the secret Santa tree. From what I understand, we just press, there's like a dispenser over there that we just press and we randomly get... The thing that we want, man, it is heaving down snow out here. Oh, man. All right, let's see. Where's the secret Santa tree? Uh, is it over there by Slacks? Oh, man, people have been doing so much work out here. If you haven't been watching the live streams or the videos with people doing stuff out here in the Winter District, oh, it's been so amazing. Oh, look, it's like a stormtrooper. These are Tis Tom's little guys. <laughs> I love them so much. I don't know what he's like. He's got is that earrings that he's got. Oh, those are, no. <laughs> I thought because he was like a punk rocker that he had earrings, but it's not. It's his arms, and that's his scarf. Oh, I love that little guy. This is Slack Lizard stuff. It's a stormtrooper. Oh, man, he's got Darth Vader over here with a lightsaber. Getting ready to cut everybody up. Is this the thing? Okay, we'll see. Oh, man, Slack Lizard's taking care of business, that's for sure. All right, let's see what we've got. Okay, green. Who do we get? Aaron, time. Let's see if we can find our way back to the nether portal. It's over here. Oh, look, there's the there's the guy. Is that Boba Fett? Oh, man, I shouldn't be looking at some of those things. There's another a snowman. Oh, man, I love it out here in the Winter District. Oh, man, I'm so excited about Secret Santa. That's an easy one. Oh, we got stuff that we can take care of for that person. That is for sure. I guess they're not supposed to know. Yeah, that's the easy one, I think. We're gonna have to we have to do a little bit of scavenging to get some materials, but that's okay. Alright, I think we can still fly down this tunnel. Yeah. Oh, it's so cool. I love it. Alright, now we're gonna head over to the shopping district because I got a little note on Discord from Slack, and Slack was like, hey man, you you might want to go over to the shopping district to the diamond tree because you might be rich. <laughs> Oh, man, I hope we are. Well, hello, Enderman. What are you doing here? Uh, I know that Tiz bought a bunch of concrete, but I would assume that all of those statues and stuff that were out there happening in the Winter District, those were didn't just come from Slack making his own concrete, baby. Woo -hoo -hoo! Oh, I think we're going to be rich. That is for sure. Oh, yeah. All right, let's fly down to the diamond tree. Now, listen, all of our diamond tree money got stolen, so now all the money that we get from the diamond tree is like straight profit. I think. Yeah. Oh, I don't think I ever noticed all the work that they did to terraform that. Jesse, Jesse and the and the crew. That looks so good. Oh man. I'm. To, I, I don't care who you are. We got some of the best building people around the world while playing this truly bedrock game. That is for sure. All right. Let's see what's happening here. Okay, we still have blackstone. 
Oh, yeah. I don't know where we should start. We have so many things to rake in here. Let's see. Okay. So, bone block. Somebody bought a bone. We can easily replenish those. That's a diamond block. We're rich now. Another brick. Stone. Gravel. Oh, we got to get more sand over here. Yeah. Logs. I don't think we're selling any of this stuff. Glass. Dirt. Oh, someone bought all of our red sand. I bet that was Gruva. Yeah. <laughs> Rake it in, baby. Redstone is still there. Smooth stone. Obsidian. No one bought that. All right, let's see what's going on here. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, man. We're so rich. Uh. <laughs> oh, let's see. Oh, man. I, need, I might need to scour my computer when I edit this video. Put the old raking it in gif. It's been a while. Jif, whatever. Oh my goodness, we're rich. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Look at all, someone buying all the cyan concrete. Oh, we're, we gotta make, we gotta go on a concrete run. That's for sure. Okay, yeah, 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 what's in here, regular? Oh my goodness, everyone bought, this is all the regular. Guess they wanna make their own colors, maybe? Oh my goodness, we have to we have to refill all of this. Okay, okay. Let's go over here and check. Man, we're so rich. What's this? Okay, okay, okay. Alright, orange. So little. Oh this was from I think Tiz Tom. Oh my goodness, he bought so much concrete. We are so loaded. Oh, we're back. Oh my goodness. We just we just keep breaking it in. I Man, I should have come over here with a wheelbarrow. We got so much loot. Oh my, we have to grind so much concrete. Oh, it's not even funny. All right, this pink. Oh, we sold a little bit of pink. Yeah. Oh, oh my goodness gracious, we are sold. We are so rich. <laughs> oh man. All right, more. Oh, what is this brown? This is from Tis Tom building all those trees. We got to get this stuff restocked asap. Tis Tom's going to be out of concrete. He's going to be building it himself. Okay, that's good. Oh, we sold a bunch of red. Yeah. Okay, no cyan. No purple. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Okay. A little bit of yellow. Oh, my goodness. A little bit of light blue and a bunch of white. Oh, my goodness. We have so much color. We got to go get tons and tons of sand. Oh, my goodness. All right, is that everything? Oh, look at, are we, okay. Let's just go, since we're out here, let's go around the corner to the dye shop and see what the deal is with dye. I think we sold some dye. I'm pretty sure we sold some to Foxy, maybe. Okay, we're still, we're still okay. There's a diamond there. There's one, okay. And there's not, even though there, there's some missing, there's no diamonds in there because it's four stacks for a diamond. You know, we don't try to rob people over here. There's a little bit. Oh, yeah, there's some more. Oh, my goodness, we're rich. <laughs> okay, all right. Oh, my goodness, how much? Look. No. Yes. Oh, man. <laughs> Wait, here, let me do this. Oh, does it? <laughs> that's, the, that's the I'm rich dance. Can we? I don't know what the, there should be a hot key. I love it. <laughs> oh, man. This is the greatest beginning of an episode ever in the history of my life. We should just go check the potion shop real real quick. I doubt there's anything in here. We have, we've been a little lazy on potion stuff. We're, we're going to have to get all that. Oh, there's no fire resistance in there. No strength. No night vision. So we got to load up all of these different things. Oh, my goodness. Okay, we got to get make more of those. Okay. All right. So we've got to do a big, at some point, probably on a live stream or something like that, we'll do a big, like, materials gathering extravaganza or something. Because we got to get everything loaded back up. I didn't realize we had sold so many stuff. Look how rich we are. Almost three and a half stacks of diamonds. Oh, yeah. Maybe people feel bad because I've been crying around on the server 24 hours a day about how poor I am. I don't think that's maybe the case. I mean, I guess it could be. 
Oh, man. I'm so rich. Oh, All right. Let me take all these goodies. I should actually put them in the ender chest. Let me get that squared away. we got to head back to the base and get ready to go do a, one more errand. And then we're going to try to actually get some work done in this episode. I'll see you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends, we are back. Okay, so I need to go back into the nether. Tis Tom, you can hear him in my nether portal. I don't know what the deal is, but I think it's just literally on the other side of my nether portal wall is Tis Tom's uh, Piglin Bartering Station. I was going to make my own, but I asked him if he would mind if I could use his, and he was like, no, go ahead, just don't take the gravel. <laughs> because I think he thinks I'm going to take the gravel and then put it in the diamond tree and then sell it back to him. That would be an awesome scam, but we're not going to do that. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. All right, so let's go around here. End portal. I think it's in here. I hear him in here. All right. So if you don't know, oh yeah, look there. Yeah. Okay, that is my portal literally right there. But let's go down. This is really hard to run through. Okay. Oh, oh no. No, no, no blow up to his stuff. No, no, no. No. Oh. goodness i hope that didn't burn did it, did it break any of his stuff oh no okay hold on ow oh i picked it up okay yeah 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 okay good all right that goes right there all right we're back well that's dangerous in here all right where's his hogland farm he said i was allowed to use it i know he showed it on camera so it's not like a spoiler or anything is it through here maybe yes Yes, yes. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so this... Okay, so I brought some gold. I have a little bit. Okay, I think we load it up on either side, maybe? Where's the minecart for this side? Oh, is it broken? Oh, it might be broken over there. I think... Oh, I think maybe it's broken. Or maybe, oh, man, no, 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 no. Okay, so we put the gold in here. It's not broken. It just goes a halfway around. Okay, that makes sense. Let's see what happens if we put a stack of gold in here. Okay, and then do the lever. Okay. Is something happening? Okay. I don't know what's supposed to happen here. Oh, did that guy just get some gold? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Or right, this this is the timer circuit here, I guess. Oh, okay. Oh, we're raking stuff in. They're both working on both sides. Oh man, this is amazing. This Tom is some kind of redstone genius, Superman. All right, let's go down here and see what goodies we have. So we have gravel. He said I'm not allowed to steal that from him. <laughs> I wouldn't anyway. Gilded blackstone. Yeah, a little bit of that. Let's see. Oh, there's lots of quartz. Okay. Leather. So I need leather. So I'm, I am going to get some leather out of here for sure. I don't need ender pearls. I don't need raggedy different armor. I don't need string. All I really need is leather. I might even need more than this. I'm going to get another stack of leather. And then he can just use all that gold. Oh, how about glowstone? How are we doing down there? Okay. Oh. Okay. So it's pretty good. I think we're raking it in, that's for sure. Will this thing just keep going around and around until we shut it off? Here, let me let me shut this off. That way when it comes back, I will I'll check to see if it's out of gold yet. Okay, it is. Okay, did they use it up already? Okay. I mean, I guess it, it doesn't take long. All right. Let me load this thing up. I'm going to put a bunch of gold in here. Like, maybe I'll put all of this. Maybe not that. We'll do it in whole stacks. Like that. Okay. Then we'll turn this on. I'm going to let this run. And then I'll bring you back on the other side after we're back at the base because now we've really got a bunch of leather. And then we've got to do a little bit of concrete work. I need tons of white. I mean tons like double chests of white. We'll have to see where we're at as far as sand and gravel. So let me let this run for a little bit. I'll see you in just a second. 
Okay, so, well, first of all, let me tell you what. Tiz's tunnel <laughs> is a death trap. For someone who's trying not to die all season long, he makes a tunnel that's not even gas, gas proof. Gas are blowing up everything that you look at. Look, I'm going to put all this extra leather. I got two stacks of leather. I also got a soul speed enchant. Uh, oh, it's only soul speed two. That's okay. I'm not too worried about it. Maybe that's the highest it can be. I've just never had one before, so I, you know, I'm going to use that. And I grabbed two netherite hose. <laughs> Only because I would like to have one, and he had like 10 or so. Man, we put a bunch of gold in there. I don't feel bad, and he said we could do it. So don't be like crying all around how I stole stuff from Tiz. He said 100% that I could go and use his hoglin bartering farm as long as I didn't take the gravel. That's what he was really worried about. Okay, so next up, I need to check to see how much black concrete I have because uh, there's been something that's bothered me, and I saw it a lot. We just had our live stream weekend this past uh, this past weekend, the weekend before Christmas. If you're watching this in the future sometime, and the shopping district portal not being the tunnel not being finished is a little on the embarrassing side. So I want to get that squared away today. Uh, do I not have black dye? We have to go out to the farm. I know we've got some out there, uh, but I'm gonna make a whole bunch of black concrete, and we're gonna finish that portal today and get that squared away. And then we'll see if we have more time at the end to maybe knock out who knows what else. We have other stuff that we need to do. Uh, we really need to start the process of decorating the inside of our base. I have this, I have this idea that I want to replace all the stone walls with white concrete and then do like cool designs on the wall. Kind of like graffiti or something. I think that might be kind of cool. Uh, but anyway, first I need to make a whole bunch of black concrete. I don't think I have the dye for it, so I'm going to have to go get some dye. Some black dye. Yep, I don't think I have it. So let me get all that stuff taken care of, and I'll meet you back over there at the Nether or at the uh, Shopping District Portal. I'll see you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends, we are back. Okay, so we're over here at the Shopping District Portal, and I was just laying out. Thankfully, we don't have to come very far on this side. We do have to get rid of all this Nether rack that's in here, and I'm going to start working on that in just a second. This side, though, we've got a pretty long stretch because remember, the Nether tunnel is like a diagonal right and the portal to the shopping district is straight so it's going to cut across but i think it'll be okay we're going to get all that cleared out i'm going to rake in some extra resources too <laughs> not worried about that um, i'm not sure what to do with this um, when i ride i, I climbed up this i don't know where it goes all the way to the top i guess we'll see but as i went up here a little bit it's a little scary <laughs> like you're just going along and then you're like oh look i'm in the middle of a lava lake so i don't really know what's all the way up here i guess we could go I mean, this might just take us up to the surface this may have been one of like the initial tunnels back when the server was brand oh no that just goes up there okay someone just put a whole bunch of so maybe this can come down i don't know i'll have to talk to liara or someone to see who actually because I can't really see anybody wanting to come up here in the middle of the lava lake. Like I don't see what really the benefit there is, but who knows? It's not my scaffolding. I'll ask and find out before we just go like shredding stuff down. It's not that big of a deal. It just impacts us a little bit. It's not a huge problem though. Okay, so we have to dig out all of this nether rack all the way down to the bedrock and then go get a bunch of glass and do all the glass work, which we'll work on for sure here in just a few minutes. And then down here at the end, we've got some more digging to do. We need to extend this tunnel all the way back to the back of the shopping district portal and then encase the whole thing in black concrete and do all that. So I do have a shulker box across the way there that has... Uh, 12, I guess now 11 stacks of black concrete, which should be enough to get what we need to done here. This isn't too much, really. The only thing that we have to be a little careful about is down this tunnel is uh, BJW's base. And he, I think a lot of times he comes down the shopping district tunnel and heads over that way. So I think what we're going to do for him because I don't want to leave like a hole. I mean, I guess technically I could. I might get some black concrete mini blocks and make a false wall so he can still like run through there if he wants to. And I guess technically, if he's super cool and knows the location, he could probably even fly and cut through. It'd be dangerous because he, <laughs> he might he might crash. But I don't know if he flies down there or not. But So that's what we have to do as far as a the rest of this tunnel. I, I do get rid of a little bit of this. This was our wall that we had before. Yep, so we're going to need to take out, I think this is it, just these pieces here. Okay, so this part of the tunnel is going to extend all the way back to there. Yep, okay. And then this guy over here 
We've got to do the same thing, too. I've got to clear out a bunch of this netherrack. I don't know what to do with this little dude. I think we might just leave him sit here. I think this is silence. Um, he trades, comes by and trades with him, puts a piece of gold in there, and clicks a button every once in a while. So I think we'll leave all of that stuff in there. Yeah. And then we'll just figure out the rest of it. Um, I guess I could talk to him and see if we can relocate him or get rid of him. I don't really want to. He's been there forever. I don't know if he's named or not, but um, maybe he is. He probably is. I think we'll just try to work around him. So I've got to do all that work. i got to move all of this material get all that cleaned out and do this front side so i'm going to work on the front side first and then we'll come back and work on the back side of the portal so i'm going to start digging out all of this material here um, because i'm digging it out i'm going to take it <laughs> i'm going to say it belongs to me now which is pretty sweet uh, we need to get it done before we don't want to have any gas spawn and we're just going to clear out these areas here i think yeah just all this. We'll get all this done, and I'll start laying in some glass and filling out the rest of the concrete, and I'll bring you back for a status update in just a few seconds. I'll see you then. Alrighty, my friends, we are back. Okay, so we've got this side of the tunnel. Uh, it's pretty much complete. We've got to finish the top a little bit. We just need to bring it out to where it's going to intersect with the uh, the sides of the portal. I would like to get a couple blocks. I'm going to have to understand Liara's pattern here maybe a little bit better so we could finish it off but in any case this part is done i'm debating on whether or not i want to take out all of this gray glass and just make the whole thing black i mean i love the way that it's i mean i wanted to do like some kind of fog effect in here but i think maybe this gray might be just a little too much we'll have to see but anyway i've got that side done and now i've got all of this dug out right here i decided to leave this little pigment guy i don't know what his deal is <laughs> i have a feeling somebody came out of the portal we're gonna get that fixed don't worry i, I posted on discord that it was a little bit uh, a little bit messed up but anyway um, i'm not sure exactly what we want to do here i think what i would like to do with this little pig man guy do we have any blocks is i think right, i do have let me put this down real quick i'm gonna need some of this glass let me get some black stained glass maybe let's just run around here and grab some stuff okay so this is an unnecessary block i believe as is this one as is this one. We're going to try to pare this thing down to its smallest components if we can. Okay, so now if I go take this one out and replace it with a black, I think I could do the same thing there on the top of this. Okay, let's go ahead and make that black glass. Okay, and then you have to be a little careful because we can't see very good. Where's our soap touch? Okay. black there okay and then we can do the same thing underneath okay okay uh, and I just want to okay let's break these down I just want to if we're gonna leave that guy there which is I'm perfectly fine with I mean I think it's silence little pig guy and I think he uses it I think I said this before but I believe he uses it every once in a while like on his live streams and stuff where people like want him to come and <laughs> and trade with the pig guy. All right, let's do that. And then like that. Okay. There. Now he's enclosed in a little black glass. So at least he'll match, right, with everything else that's going on. Okay, I like that. All right, let's get this out of the way. Now I brought over with me, I just had to go back and make a ton of different colored glass. We're going to get a bunch of the different colors here. And I've got to fill up this part right here so it matches. There's our... Um, our fog effect I, I still don't know what we're going to do for the top I'm not 100 percent sure but what i do know is we're going to go along the bottom here it's really hard to see over here so i'm not going to keep you guys around for this entire process and we're going to put black glass on the bottom like this and i've just been because it's sometimes hard to see the difference of the colors just use your middle mouse button you can pick block right so we can go like that Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to go back. Okay. So, anyway, I'm going to do all these level. Le le <laughs> I'm going to do all of these layers. Oh, my goodness. I was watching a Slack, Slack Listers video from, I guess, yesterday. I mean, he has trouble. I feel, feel so bad having trouble with words because he has trouble with words, too. I don't know what he was, Githering, I think he was trying to say. Poor guy. I have the same problem. We must have been have the same affliction or something. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to get all this filled up. I'll bring you back on the other side. We'll take a look. I do need to get some black concrete and fill out this back wall here, which I will do as well. So let me get this done, and I'll see you in just a second. 
Alrighty, my friends. Now, what I did here is I added instead of this top this top layer of gray glass, I added another layer of black stained glass. So it's two layers of black stained glass. It makes it so we can see a little bit better. I think it actually looks makes it look more foggy than just like this. So I, of course, what that means is we've got so you can see the difference, right? So we can sort of see down below, which was kind of what I wanted to do. I wanted to show that it was all the way down to bedrock, which is kind of cool. So that means we've got a long grind ahead of us. We have to take all of this mess out like that. That's for sure. That's going to take a while. But before we do that, I did want to come over here and just... Let's just see what this looks like with... Okay. I don't want to go down into the bad stuff. Okay. And let's just go across here. Oh, this one, I don't have to worry about those, I don't think. Okay, let's just get the rest of this cleaned out. Okay, that's too far. Okay, all right, let's put some of these back. We want it to start right here. Okay, and then I think we can go like this. Let's just go ahead and fill this side up here all the way if we can. We only have a couple pieces of charcoal, or uh, black concrete. Why did I say charcoal? <laughs> Makes sense. All right, let's see. Oh, okay. Uh, how do I get out of here? I'm stuck in here forever. All right, we're going to have to go over here, I guess. Okay. Yeah, I think that's going to look awesome. It's going to sort of finish up that edge right there. Okay, so that means I'm going to have to go make a little bit more black concrete as well as dig out all the gray glass from here, smelt up a bunch of bl a new glass, and convert it all to black. Oh, man, it's going to take forever. All right, I'm going to get to it. I'll see you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends, we're back. Okay, I think we've got this tunnel completely done. We've got it meshed. It, it looks so good. Oh man, it, I mean, it's not like some amazing design. I just love the way that it's so dark and black and kind of scary looking. I think it looks really good. Um, the other thing that I love, we're, we're, we have to make one further modification to um, our portal or our tunnel here. I was going to originally go in and put some lights. I even have them in my inventory, some seed lanterns. I was going to go all the way down to the bottom where like a piece of black concrete is like right there. Go all the way down at the bottom, uh, use soap touch, put it in there, replace the layers, and then do that all the way along. And maybe at some point we still might do that. But here's what I love. If you go out here and you look down the tunnel, it's got like a purple glow. I love it. I can't mess with that. Oh man, it's amazing. So what we need to do is we just need to increase the size of the portal so we get more of that super awesome purple glow shining down at the end of the tunnel. I think that's going to look really good. So we're just going to tear down this old uh, portal. I've got two stacks of obsidian. We're going to make this portal essentially as big as we can, I guess. Let's get uh, some stuff moved around. Let's take these guys off there. Okay. Yeah. So I think, oh, we got that guy all squared away. I think I do need to put, do I have any glass with me? No. I think I need to put a piece of glass on top of that dropper or dispenser, whatever it is. Dropper, yep. Because I think maybe mobs can spawn. But regardless, we're going to tear this portal down. All I'm going to do is we're, we need to center it, really. So we can actually keep this side in place. We need to break this side here. I know it's super dark. I'm going to try to... I don't think I have any torches in my inventory. Nope. I could light something on fire. Can I light glass on fire just so you guys could see what we're doing? No. <laughs> okay. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. I could light this on fire. Yeah. Okay. So all I'm going to do is this thing goes all the way over there already. So let's get our soap touch out. We're going to go... We're going to go like this. Okay. And then we're going to put obsidian like that. And then our portal's going to start here. But we're going to go all the way to the roof. I know it's super dark. It's dark for me, too. Oh, do I have another kind of temporary block I can use? I think so. Okay. Yeah. And then we're going to... I think we can come across the ceiling. Let's put a temporary block there. Just, it's really hard for... I know it's hard for you guys to see. I'm going to lighten it up a lot, just so maybe we can see better um, on the actual video. 
let's uh, drag our netherrack across here so we can build this huge portal. I'm hoping it doesn't mess with where this portal goes. I'm hoping that it's still going to be okay. I mean, obviously, we're going to test it in just a second. All right, let's bring our obsidian over. Okay. And then we're going to go... that and then we want to go one more like that okay so we sort of have that like that portal that doesn't have uh, corners okay then we can tear all that down can we land down there yeah professionals at this game and now we can take out all of these guys reclaim this obsidian and then I mean uh, this portal that portal might actually just light up as soon as we're done let's go put out the fire so it doesn't light up automatically okay I don't think that would have worked anyway. All right, so now we have that. We have our new, newly sort of sized portal. We can light that guy up. Now it's not only centered, but it's a lot bigger. That looks so good. Oh, let's go down here at the end. <laughs> oh, man. I love this tunnel. It's like, I don't know. It's really, oh, hello. Why don't I have more of that? I need to go get more of those carpet pieces. I'll do that as soon as I'm done working on the video. I thought I'd finished all those. Perhaps I haven't. Let me see. Is it there? Hmm. Uh, oh, no, lava. Lava came down when I was putting those things. Okay, it just burned up. But check that out. Look. It's got like a purple glow. Come on, man. <laughs> oh, I love it so much. We're going to call the video right there. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it so much. Until next time, please remember to be cool. Let's turn this off. Don't be a fool. And from my Truly Bedrock Let's Play series where we finally got this portal taken care of. And on top of that, we raked it in at the diamond tree. Oh, man. That means we have so much work to do. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.